What is up, everyone? Welcome back to some more Red Dead. Um, I don't even know what I'm gonna do today. <laughs> Maybe explore some more. Probably do a couple more main missions. We'll see. Oh shit! Every time I spawn in, my my dead eye is always so low. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Take nap, then travel. So it'll be good. It'll be fine. It's all good. Oh damn it! What an inconvenient timing you have given me, game. <laughs> So to night, that is so much sleeping because it just turned morning, but you know what? Arthur could use some sleep. <laughs> Where is it? <laughs> Why did that look so funny? I started walking forward. Where are we going, horsey? You're supposed to go this way. <laughs> no one likes me here. I remember helping that guy come back over here. And they said, like, be careful. And that's all I remember. I can't remember what he said. Be careful. <laughs> but I remember it was creepy. The wisdom of the elders. Ah, be gone, sir. Be gone. Not, not, not because we cares not. No, no, but because we cares. What are you talking the about? Demons have us by the stone, sir. It's the darkness. The darkness, it's, it's everywhere. The, he was right. What are you talking about? They come in Pigs. darkness. Somebody please help. They're coming. Pigs. Oh, somebody help. What's happening? Stay inside. Keep your door shut. What is happening? Kill the demon? bad. Ma'am, safe now. See if there's any more of them. Oh, thank you, brother. Oh. Shit, there's more, all right. Oh, God. What is happening in this place? What is going on? Damn, please. I'm on my way. Get back. Are you okay? I was going to the Kane. bathroom. They've got Brother Kane. Where? Over there. Alright, I'll oh handle god. this. Oh god. Oh god. On the bridge, Brother Kane. Woo. <laughs> oh, there's more coming from behind. You two, back to the village. I'll keep these dogs at bay. What is happening? Oh shit. Oh shit. Lay dead. <laughs> Why are there so many? What is, is this? A gang of dogs? It's not demons. It's just dogs. Gone crazy. Hey, nice. Get yourselves home. No, no, no. He said, he said they on? would come in many forms. <laughs> and, he, and he said his protection would come in many, many forms. forms. What are you talking about? It's just sick dogs. Uh, hydrophobia or some other poison. He said we were not to doubt him. No. Get your people home, mister. Then get yourself a gun and kill any sick animals you see. Life will be just fine. The darkness has come for us. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he was right. Who was right? I was. I shall save them. And who are you? There will be no more. Four-legged demons. The curse shall change. The curse has changed. What curse? These poor people. I will save you. <laughs> I just saved them, and it weren't no curse. It's just sick dog. Dark charms. Possess the woods, I told you. Oh, he, he, did. he told me he did. He, he told me I found one. Mm. That? Don't touch They it. found the curse! Found it. So? The woods are full of these. 
While they remain, the curse will remain. The oh, curse. curse. Oh. Yet the woods are also full of demons. Oh. I will find a way. Oh, have I lied to you thus? He never lied to me. Oh. Mm. Come, Obadiah. Feed me. So, you're saying if someone destroys those charms, the curse is lifted? The woods are full of demons. And the demons protect the charms. And the charms protect the demons. It's impossible. I can see that. It's impossible. Yeah, there ain't no demons. Don't disturb the woods. I told you. He would come. <laughs> Arthur losing his mind. He would help. And he would laugh. Uh, yeah, you, you told us. Smart people. Well, oh, great timing. Once again. Destroy the charms near Butcher's Creek. No, okay. <laughs> We're gonna do that because... I don't know if I trust that guy. He seems... Interesting. To say the least. Come on, horsey, let's go. I'm bringing you with me. Damn, I feel like I'm running so fast. Oh god. Destroy the cursed charms. Okay. Aha. I see them. when I broke this other one. Oh, I had to like hit it the other part of it. There it is. Damn it. <laughs> 13? How many did this guy place? Here one. Okay, horsey, uh you you stay there. Stay here, boy. <laughs> I know you wanna help. But I got this, okay? Me trying to find it. Okay, it seems like all of them over here. Ooh, that was way deeper than I thought. What the fuck? <laughs> I was not expecting that. Hmm. How big is this? area. Oh, I definitely have to cross around them. For sure. What's that? Got prompt, but I don't know what it was. Oh! <laughs> What's that? <laughs> Why'd you fall? I know, it's slippery. I'm trying, game. Give me a second. 
I gotta get over here. <laughs> There's gotta be some over here, right? Yeah. I was like, cause there's like a lot more. I can't even see because of the tree <laughs> between me. There we go. Get that shit out of here. I hear another one. Are you crazy? Oh yeah, I do. This one. And this one. There we go. Got them all. Nothing was protecting them, so. Makes it easier. You ready? Yep. Let's get back there. Very protected charms. Of course. Just as I had guessed. Hey, what up? Hi there, mister. You look sicker than blank mail. <laughs> Thanks. How sweet of you. <laughs> okay, what you gotta say to me now? Huh? Remember me? I help with those dogs. I've been seeing like about this ten minutes ago. <laughs> Welcome, brother. It's a dark omen. Those charms out in the woods, they all been broken. All of them? So I guess that's it for your suffering. Ah! It's a miracle! We're saved! The darkness lifted! Not saved. Huh? Cursed. Huh? He broke the charms. And the spirits are set loose. We're doomed then? Hold on. You said the charms was protecting the curse. I said it was a dark omen. I said he had the demon's tongue. Right, now I, I, I need I need some light here now. I, yeah, I don't know what to think. Hey, huh? look at me. Yeah? I think something's going on in this holler. And it ain't a curse. And whatever else it ain't. This fella don't want you to know. Mm -hmm. Lie! I told you he would lie and dissemble. Something's up, and this one wouldn't be so quick with ideas he didn't have some clue of it. I have the gift. My ancestor. Well, I got a gift right here. I'm going to commune with the spirits. <laughs> Dark. <laughs> Dark omens! Yeah. Get out Dark of here. spirits! What is he hiding? He, he, all, he always spoke truthful to us. There, there is a dig on the other side of the hill there. There was a dig anyway. It's closed now. He always said something about not going over there. Well, maybe I'll take a look at that dig. See if I can see <laughs> something. Uh, right. <laughs> what is happening in this place? Come on, horsey, you and me. We gotta go investigate this. I gotta know. I can't ride in a straight line. Are you okay, Horsey? What is going on? Oh, <laughs> Let's go see. Legendary fish, oh god. In the hell? <laughs> Jesus, what is going on? I can't even see them. Why are they hitting me? How is he not? Wing. Let's go, boy. I've never gone. What is your problem? What hey, happened? Easy now. You're letting him get away. Oh, boy. Yes. You gonna let him do that? 
Whoa, now, easy, easy, easy there. What was going on? What? Is, what is wrong with you? <laughs> Why are you freaking out? I think it has something to do with being on that body that Whoa, made this a pain in the butt. What? Yeah, it was literally just being on that body that freaked out my horse. What is going on? What? What is your problem? I'm leaving you here, but I love you, okay? I love you. I'll be back. You stay here. You calm down. And then I'll be back, okay? That's what I think of you. That's what I think of you. Give me all your shit. Hey. What are you Come doing on. here? I, I miss you. Oh my it's god. Funny. Why are you over here? I Come back to me! I can't believe this! Shit. I thought we were friends! I thought we were gonna conquer America together! Please! Out of the way, please. Gav! Morning. <laughs> this is ridiculous, man! Why are you over You're here? You're telling me. Might be time to... call it quits. You hmm. what? Have you gone mad? I love that boy. Big bloody dope that he is. No, no, I'll find him. Oh, he's, he's probably just off on a spree if I know Gav. <laughs> well, good luck. How are you still, what, what are you still doing? Oh, I am so... Gav. I don't want to... Gav. I don't want to do this, but... Gav! <laughs> that looks so funny. Bad day for you, mister. What is going on? Come okay. on, please. I feel bad. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to kick you. <laughs> Come on, man. Let's go. We'll, we'll go. We're gonna find Gavin together. Hold on. We just gotta go somewhere where I won't get spotted. Okay. I'm gonna steal your shit. This is uh, very kind of you. Let her tell me. I want to go home. See, now I feel bad. <laughs> Ooh. Dear Nigel, I was so happy to hear from you. I cannot believe it, mate. My two friends, you and Gavin. Boys, I grew up with now real rich and successful cowboys in America. That's incredible news. Well done, Talk mate. Seriously. Me. Well done. I knew you and Gavin would find success over there. I mean, it stands to reason a pair of boys from Little Maidenhead, Berkshire, now successful over in America. I might come and join you myself. Now that the two of you have done so well, both of the- both of you- Rich and living in big mansions with servants and all of them cattle. This is a I remember out of my depths here. Did you just get away? Come back. How did he get out? I'm sorry. Come back. No. Faster than you. Ah, out of the way. Oh, I feel bad. Okay, you stay there. I'll be reading this. <laughs> um, I remember when the height of your ambition was pretending you were a Londoner and seeking if you fooled these those Scotch boys we met by the barracks. Funny thing is, Gavin never mentioned none of his none of this in his letter. But he was always a bit of a quiet one, and I reckon you wrote after he did. Either way, I made up my 
I made up the pair of you two. Made up cowboys, millionaires. We miss you, especially your mom, since your dad passed on. But she told me she was proud of you. Even Gavin's mom was happy. She said her usual piece about not thinking you had it in you. But she smiled and said she knew her boy would, sen would see sense or make sense of something eventually. Berkshire forever. Your pal, Tom. I saw that bloke, Brian Gold, the other day in the market. He said some real odd things about you, which I said weren't true. Bet he's laughing on the other side of his face now. Interesting. So this guy's name is Nigel. Nigel! Nigel! You see my friend Nigel? Where are you, Nigel? 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 Has anyone seen Nigel? What am I even looking for? Oh, I'm... Uh, this is a dig. Oh. Time to break into it. Do it, Arthur. Hell yeah. <laughs> nice. I don't know if I want to go... <laughs> <laughs> this became a horror game all of a sudden. Oh, thank God you brought that along. Why is it not odd though? Oh, that's okay. <laughs> Why are we in here? This looks so dangerous. It's over here. Nothing. Also nothing. Hmm. <coughs> eee. This looks disgusting. <coughs> we should not be in here. pick up the rat. That's disgusting. Why am I taking the rat? Why why did I take that? <laughs> yeah, it looks cursed all right. Like disgusting. Yeah. What if I dip my hands in that? Who's there? I see you over there. The game's up. There's poison in this mine. <laughs> oh my. Jesus Christ. God damn you. I'm getting out That of scared here. me so bad. Oh, my health. Healed. The fumes are choking you. Follow the stream out. Follow the stream out. Where, though? <coughs> but like where? Here? I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Like where? <laughs> what streams? I don't even I don't even know. Oh god. Run. Go oh, here. God damn. Go, go, go. Damn. We don't got time to ponder. We gotta get out of here. But I will leave him. This is gonna be bad for my. It's probably bad. A golden nugget. Yeah. We're gonna have to greet some people. Why can't I open my weapon? Who's well, this? Run off heading. Huh? We gotta just go. <coughs> gotta go somewhere. Oh my god. No! Oh, shit. 
I see it right here. <laughs> Get out, hurry. Thank God. Jesus. Rice. <laughs> Why? I will murder that man. Why didn't it let me open my weapon meal? That was really awkward. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> Are you okay? I was trying to get you to eat some food. Come on, come on. <laughs> okay, we gotta get out of here. I'm running. I don't got time to look for any. Why are there so many dead rats in here? I don't need them right now. I'll come back if I need them. They're all over the ground. get down and then he fell. <laughs> Why? Go, go, go. Hey, shoot! Shoot, get out of here! It ain't safe! What did that say? It popped up for like 0 0.1 second. I didn't even get to see what that said. <laughs> I'm guessing it said return to them, but... <laughs> Thanks. Yeah. Dude, get me out of that hell hole. Thank you very much. Now we gotta make up our honor for stealing from Nigel. <laughs> and for looting that dead guy. <laughs> and now I feel bad. Hey there, mister. What? <laughs> that guy always hates me. It's kind of hilarious. Hey, boy. Hi, folks. Howdy. How do, sir? Nice to see some friendly faces around here. No. Anyone else I can talk to? I told you I would save you. Yes. Said I would lead you out of the darkness. Yes. Show us the light. I shall. I shall. But first, you have to mark your signs on this paper. Mm -hmm. It's a powerful magic that will protect you yeah, yeah, yeah. on your journey. Uh, what illegal contract? Stop reading. You didn't tell me you could read? What kind of trick you pulling now? Oh, mm -hmm. you're back! We thought the curse had got you. Nope, but he nearly did. Don't you go nowhere. I was down that old dig and I found this leaking all the way into the lake. Uh, You've been poisoned. No, no, no. We, we, we were warned not to heed what you That's say. Right. Well, let him tell you then. What's this? It's nothing. Nothing? Oh, then you won't mind taking oh, a drink. Hey, no. hey, hey, hey! No. Hey! Hey! Please. hey. hey. No! No! Yeah. Oh, you've killed me! I'm poisoned! Poison now, is it? Uh, yeah. oh, oh, the dig. All they found was arsenic and lead. Oh, God. They dug down into the cave system and spread. I was meant to uh, get you all to go. Uh, now you heard it. It's taken me. Oh, oh dear. dear. Good riddance. Oh, there's no arguing. It's clear as day. We're cursed. <laughs> cursed? Oh. What are you talking about? <laughs> Arthur. Powerful forces have taken on this town. It ain't oh, spirits. Yes. It's a mining company. No, it is spirits. Spirits taken through a mining company. Brothers and sisters. We got some praying to do. Yes, you don't know. pray. Do something. You'll die. Or you worse. Just go. It's our curse. It's ours to deal with. Now okay. the best man left some money. They just take it if you want it. I don't want your money. But thanks. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh, cool. We got our our stuff back. Uh, hello. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're 
gonna pause. I'm gonna save just in case the game crashes, because you never know. <clears throat> okay. <sighs> now I'm back. <laughs> I have to go do some stuff, but we're back. Excuse me, come in. What's your story, huh? <laughs> I'm not a hater, I'm a racist! And I want you to be the same! What the fuck? Did I just hear? I want you to ask yourself, do I consider myself pure? And then I want you to ask yourself, what is the most disgusting, revolting, vulgar, and depressing thing in all creation? Mingling. Co-mingling. Nature? Nature likes purity. Nature does not like co-mingling. Nature likes a family tree, not a family bush. And this being America, and us being nature's paradise on Earth, we must push for purity. I want you, I need you, to be pure. So you're the master race, huh? You, sir, do you want a pamphlet? Uh, no. No, you pathetic moron. Moron? These are facts. I bet you imagine a world where your grandchildren are subservient to monkeys. You're pathetic. No, well, we cleaned out the trash. I guess that's what we came to St. Denise to do. Hopefully no one gets mad at me. I certainly am glad you feel so good about it. Oh, this poor guy. <laughs> I thought they wanted to do something else. <laughs> Why do so many people get shit dropped on them here? <laughs> Is that a common occurrence? <laughs> That worries me. <laughs> it didn't seem like no one cared. No one's gonna be missing him. <laughs> oh, I have journal entry. What did I write about? Oh wait, is it because I mugged Nigel? Bacchus Bridge blew up a bridge with Marston. Either to stop the army killing us quite so easily, quite so easily when we attempt to rob the last train, or because we want to encourage Uncle Sam to send another train full of payroll for us to rob. Whole thing seems even more ludicrous and moth-eating when I write it down. Dutch is now acting crazy, and I'm acting crazy back. I'm facing death and acting foolish. I hope Marston uses his brain. The time for hero heroics and loyalty to people is over. The time is for acting right and saving. Bitch, I was reading. Oh, it's because my controller died. There we go. Uh, I hope Marston uses it. Wait. The time for acting right and saving the innocent, not the guilty. What Wallace. Went with Charles to save Eagle Flies. They was going to hang him, I think. Rescued him out of Fort Wallace in a storm. I don't feel so good. I see clearly, and I see nothing at all. Whole place has gone to hell. Dutch talking nonsense, and folk undecided as to see they, as if they see him as the only hope or an anchor dragging us all to the bottom of the ocean. I hope John has more brains in his head than sometimes I fear he does. I should have, well, it's a bit late for regrets. There, there's a whole lot I should have done, and even more I shouldn't have done. Aww, Arthur, stop. But I suppose every man has enough regrets as to let him die happy. Just hope I did some good once I learnt to see the world for what it was. It my fault the process took quite as long as it did. Oh, Mary, be happy. Please be happy. Tilly, Mary Beth, save Karen if she ain't too far gone. John, protect Abigail and Jack. Oh. 
Why does it feel like he's riding a will? <laughs> Rains fall, save your son, as you could not save your people. Dutch, start listening to them, as they really love you. <sighs> Went back to that place, Butcher's Creek. The locals thought they were being acted by demons, and I think they were just sick dogs. Seems Obadiah the Elder is possessed by the snake oil shaman fellow that turned up. He wants me to destroy some cursed charmed charms in the woods and around there. We shall see quite what the shaman's game is, but there's some nonsense afoot. Destroyed the charms, went back to the village. Now the shaman announces things are worse because I destroyed the charms. Remarkably convenient. I was about to give him a beating when he ran off. The elder said the shaman was interested in the mine shaft. Perhaps that is worth a look. Oh god, the rats. <laughs> the rats that I took <laughs> went to the mine looking to figure out or figure what ho hold that weird shaman has over the village. I don't know why exactly, just seemed important, I guess. The whole place was a fil was filthy. And something nasty was leaking into the water and the soil. I'm no expert, but that stuff might as well explain why all the folks in Butcher's Creek are so odd. Anyway, I made my way back to the village armed with this knowledge and a little of the evil-looking water. Lo and behold, I find the shaman trying to force the duped elder into signing away his and the village's property rights. Or rights to get a mining company to leave. It was not quite clear which. The sham shaman starts attacking me so i force him to drink some of his some of them run off he admits all promptly loses his mind and i'm raiding around to be treated like the hero i am or not the villagers blame the curse at this point i left them to their dreams of specters <laughs> we could really help them i mean we did what we could okay, and that's what so matters are those breaking my heart man legendary animal legendary alligator it is. Fucking do it. <laughs> Maybe later, alligator. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> that was terrible. <laughs> no. That one's gotta go. <laughs> Someone help me! Hello? Is that the snake bass? Again? <laughs> No. <laughs> My horse is terrified of the What happened? <laughs> Again? And we got nothing else. <laughs> uh, I can't believe I'm doing this. Hold still. <laughs> you. Never again. <laughs> oh, I owe you so much, mister. I can't believe you saved my life twice. Me neither. Well, I best be getting back to town. I'm gonna eat a stiff one tonight. <laughs> That's it. You ain't getting another out. <laughs> what the fuck? If I see you again, I swear I'm not doing nothing. <laughs> Three times is more than enough. Okay, time to go to creepy house part two. Hey there! Oh, you guys, you want to talk? <laughs> Don't be shy, partner. I wasn't last no time. I went through your whole house. Here. <laughs> That's a fact. I walked right in last time. Hello, Mister. Yeah. You look like you need to take a load off. Well, ain't this a rare treat? Why didn't you tell me we had guests coming? I'd have fixed myself up nice. Oh, now you know you look perfect, princess. <laughs> uh, I ain't no guest, miss. I'm just passing through. Oh, nonsense. Well, come on in. Rest a while, and we got food on the stove and a bottle of the good stuff we've been saving. It's decided then. I'm gonna go freshen up. <laughs> I appreciate the offer, but I, I best be on my way. Oh, come on now. How you gonna turn down a hot meal and good company? <laughs> I'll go open that bottle. <laughs> I guess I'm coming. <laughs> Hi-ho, 
hope she ain't primping for hours up there. We'll never eat. Go check on her, will you? Me? Okay. I'm well, going. Just go hurry her I've up. been in here before. <laughs> she won't listen to me. <laughs> Hello? <gasps> well, look who it is. You are hungry, ain't you? <laughs> I didn't mean to intrude, miss. <laughs> it's all right. Looking ain't a crime. You go on and have a seat at the table. I'll be down in a minute. No, okay. <laughs> he uh, just asked me to check on you, that's all. Oh, you don't need to make any excuses. <laughs> excuses no for sorry. what? <laughs> I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> I'm not gonna antagonize people that invited me into their home, even though I probably shouldn't be in here. Even though I was in here before. She'll uh, be down in just a minute. Woohoo! That is what I like to hear. Hey, now pull up a chair, partner. Oh, hey! Hey! Wait, this is just about perfect. God. One of them moments you wish could last forever. Well, like I said, uh, I can't stay for long. Then look at us. Like a couple of old friends. <laughs> oh, it's a short life, but a merry one. Here we are, all the fixings. I hope you boys left some room in your trousers. Mmm, that smells delicious. <laughs> the food don't smell too bad, neither. Oh, stop <laughs> it, you! How do you like it? Mm, it's good. Different. Mmm. Mm. Mm hmm. That meat is so tender. Mm -hmm. You know what? This place used to be a pig farm when we was when we was kids. Yeah. Before we lost our ma and pa. Horrible business. Horrible. But we still got each other, ain't that right, honey pie? And we still know how to have a hog killing time. There, there. That's for you. Yeah. There. Yeah. Mm. 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 Where are my manners? <laughs> Drinks. Yeah, I could definitely use a drink. <laughs> what is happening? Now there were bones up in her closet. <sighs> that stuff will put air on your chest. Oh, I doubt he needs that. Let's loosen you up some more. Uh, no. Come on, honey. I don't know. What do I do? <laughs> this is such a bad idea. It'll get you warmed up. <laughs> <laughs> this is such a bad idea. <laughs> uh, oh, what the hell is that? It's an old Aberdeen home recipe. That one right there is in 1894. Well, feels like someone's stabbing me in the head. Come this is on, such a bad I idea. I a man here, not a boy. <laughs> oh my one god. One more, and you and I both will go upstairs and have a lie down. I'm gonna have to decline. Ah, what the hell? Oh, Arthur! I didn't even get to choose. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Arthur, this is not a good idea. Oh, about time! And take whatever cat she has on her. Put behind mom. What is happening? <laughs> this is just a bad idea. I'm thinking that's what's going on. I think they eat people. I'm terrified. I'm so scared. And I will kill them all. <laughs> Okay, they said put it behind Mama. I remember there was, there was a painting when I was in there before. You! You ain't... 
Is she coming at me to stab me? Let oh my. Did he kill her? You're still alive? Did he shoot her? I'm pretty sure he shot her. This is the picture. I remember looking at it <laughs> when I was in here before. I don't think I shot her. Nice. Let's see what they have on them. Nice. I guess. A chocolate bar. Ooh, candy. Now, where was that one closet? So, were they brother and sister? Ooh. That's what I was getting out of it. <laughs> Not 100%. But they both said mom and pa. And then, ugh, yeah. <laughs> I like how it's still looted from last time I was in here. This is the, yeah. Uh, six sons of bitches. Yeah. Let's open it again. <laughs> this, yeah. I'll pass. Thanks, though. Nice. Ooh, what's this? I didn't come in here last time. Oh, damn. Damn. Well, that was good. Looks like we got some money out of that, horsey. How you been? Did you watch them drag me away? And you did nothing. Hey, Pearson, actually, I got something for you. I think I already gave you a perfect alligator skin, but you know. Pearson? Arthur? I need a. Could really I can't even. Some good meat for this stew. Ah, now I could turn this into something special. Very good. We were getting low. Low on alligator teeth. <laughs> Thank you, Arthur. I mean, I don't judge, but. <laughs> hey, there's something over there. See a little exclamation mark. Hey, it's a you. Hey, Mary Beth. Okay, Arthur. How are you doing? This place, it's horrible. Have you seen inside that cave? Oh, no. It's only for now. Hang in there. Okay, Arthur. Hi, Arthur. Hi. Things are gonna be okay, Jack. Can I go play in the cave? No. No. <laughs> safe in there. Yeah, please don't. Okay. Guess I'll leave you to it then. Okay. No, hey, I forgot I had this. Yeah. That storybook you lost. Thanks so much, Uncle Arthur. Do you want to have this? I found it in your camp. Sure. Thanks, Jack. Oh, you gave me a chocolate. Bar. I have two chocolate bars now. Nice. No. Hmm. How's it going, guys? Why does no one want to talk to me? Why are these 
H2 still here? Mm -hmm. Old pals of Micah's. They're getting real comfortable. We need guns for what's coming. Cleet and Joe know how to fight. <clears throat> it's lucky I bumped into them. What is going on, Dutch? What is happening to us? What's happening to you? You show him some respect. Excuse me. Mr. Vandalin! Mr. Morgan! Charles! They try to kill my people for oil! For oil! Today we ride once more! Ride with me! Ride with us! Ride with us against the factory! I love your courage, son! It is a thing of great beauty! Stop! Everyone, stop! What is happening? My son! My last son! Don't! When I was your age, I fought. I saw death. I have killed. The men I knew were slain. My firstborn, your brother, had his head smashed by a drunken soldier. My wife had her throat slit. I made peace. I knew not to trust, yet I had no choice. Maybe you were right. Maybe the slow death is worse than the fast one. Maybe none of these men are good. Maybe a world in which they came to us is a world that we cannot endure. But endure we must. Father, you are tired. Do not die for pride, my son. We have suffered too much in this trick. The earth, the water, they have no pride. They endure. And we must endure. My only boy, my precious boy, do not mistake my strength for weakness. As your chief, I implore you. Your words mean nothing to me, father. Don't. Run with me, now! Stop. Please, stop. Please. Mr. Morgan, after you helped me after we spoke, this is just a trap. My son, my people will all die. You help this fellow, Arthur? Please. What of it? What else you been doing behind Dutch's back? I don't need to what? tell Dutch everything. The wars are over. We have lost. These young men will be annihilated. Please. I'll see what I can do, Charles. Who else will come with me? Oh, I'll ride, Arthur. Who knows what other secrets I'll learn about. Who else? I will. So and me. Annoying. Me too. Oh, and me. I guess. <laughs> All right. Let's ride out. I'm gonna bomb it right now. What else have you been doing behind my back, Arthur? I was trying to stop this mess from getting any worse. That you were that making work. worse. Why the hell would they attack the oil fields? What do you mean? It's perfect. This was your idea? Partly. The army, the government, the industrialists. They've taken everything from these people. Wouldn't you want to fight back? You've handed them a death sentence. Just like John if we hadn't got him out of that prison. Hey, show some goddamn respect. Shut up. You'll know when I ain't showing respect, Bill. I had a plan. I still have a plan. What plan? What goddamn plan, Dutch? Tahiti? Pimbuktu? That's enough. What's wrong with you all? What happened to loyalty? Yeah, what did? Thank you, <laughs> Javier, Bill. Right now, it doesn't matter how we got here. These men need our help. I have a plan. This is the plan. So either stick with me or cut loose. Because I am tired of this constant descent. Long tired of it. Now come on. Sorry, Javi. Didn't mean to cut you off. 
Look up ahead. Mm, it's one of them. I'm not Are you all right, right son? Now. Eagle flies. He needs help. They all need help. Quick. Somebody help no. him. No, go. Please hurry. I'll be. Come on. Yeehaw! They weren't even gone that long. What's happening? Come on, Dodge. Man, and anyone see eagle flies? There, going across the walkway. Got what you wanted, Dutch. You coming, Arthur? I'm gonna try and save him. This fight is unwinnable. If you go and distract them and let me get to him, have it your way. The rest of you ride with me. Let's meet up at the factory. Let's ride. Yeah. Go with him. Try and help there. I'm better off alone. We're riding with you. Come on, then. Hell yeah. That's right. <laughs> I warn you. This is for our people. Now you pay. Get him out of here. Damn it. Still more up there? I didn't see this other guy. I can't hit him. Oh, they died. <laughs> I was like, why can't I hit this guy? Oh my! <laughs> like what is what? <laughs> there we go. Jesus Christ! <laughs> what was going on? Quick, let's get across the bridge. Come on. Thank you. All of you. We need to go. Where are my men? Where are my men? We saw some fighting by the factory. That's where Dutch is gone. Let's go, quick! Ugh. Any men we see, we must save them. Let's find the others. We need to get to the factory, Bill. We'll kill all of you. Bunch of goddamn cowards. All of you deserve to die. Let's move. Jesus. You went, like, right out there. either of them. <laughs> the guy. I hit the wall instead. No hiding. God, there's more. Oh God! Watch out for that Gatling gun. Look out! Damn it! 
Why is it left me? <laughs> I can't. This guy's still alive? There we go. I was like, I hit him twice. Didn't hit his head. I can't keep up with him. So good of you to join us. Hello, son. Hey. Saved your life. He did. Hey, you're quite the hero, Arthur, ain't you? Just a regular good guy. Same as always. What <laughs> is it with you, Arthur? What is it? I don't get you. I don't get you no more. Oh, the doubting. The doubting. Come on, get him out of here. I was down in Dutch way earlier on. on, too. Let's go finish things. Finish what? Oh, the doubts. You know why I wanted them to attack this place? I have no idea. <laughs> Javier, you, you don't tell me anything you anymore. Until I find all my men. I'm not leaving. As you wish. Rest of you, get out of here. I'm staying with you. We're getting our ticket out of here. We need to find the office. It's upstairs on the other side. I broke in here before to get those papers for Eagle Flies. That's better, Arthur. A little help. Come on, son. What are we looking for? Money, you fool. The money. There's state bonds here. Lots of them. I thought you were paying attention. Old Cornwall had a deal with the state. He was being paid to develop the region against the federal government's wishes as they didn't want problems with the Indians. Anyway, so we get it and we're done? We're almost free? Yes. If we're right, we've had tough times, the toughest of times, but come on, don't doubt me no more. Don't doubt you no place. more. I gotta be here somewhere. Yeah. I don't know. I've been here before. Check that cupboard by the door. Yeah. Oh, what's in here first? Get some stuff. I'll be taking that <laughs> for later. I got some cash. Only twenty, anyways. I got him. I got him. I got him. This is it. 
You say bonds? How much? It's a, a few thousand dollars worth? Maybe more. <laughs> oh, we are nearly there. Arthur, we're nearly there. Mr. Morgan, let's go home. Let's get out of here, Arthur. I don't know. I feel so, like so off right now. Like my stomach. I actually feel sick. <laughs> and I don't know. I don't know. I just don't feel. I don't, I don't know something. It just feels off. Did you hear that? Gentlemen, we're here for you. Your friend. Get in there. Shoot him. Find him now. coming. Should be. Come on. We need to go. You. You ran away. Oh, I did no such thing. Don't be a fool. They could be back here any minute. You disgust me. We that. did it, gentlemen. Oh, we got some money. And with the train job. But <laughs> well, we got a whole lot of money. Come on. Everything is coming together. Exactly as I planned. Shut up. I've got to take the boy to his father. As you wish. Usually he is nowadays. Sure. <clears throat> Come on. We got to get back to camp and prepare. Let's ride. I'll be back when I can. I'll stay with you. And me, of course. And so will I. No, get out of here. Please. This ain't going to be nothing nice. Be safe, Arthur. All right, come on. Let's get him to what PT as fast as we can. We gotta go. Hold on, my friend. Our men. Uh, we must go back for the bodies. We will. Guess Save I'm not much of Dutch's son. My friend, I'm sorry. About this. About all of this. You have nothing to be sorry for. You know, Dutch. Dutch is. I guess my thinking is he used you. Mm-hmm. He wasn't trying to help anyone but himself and his own crazy principles. We're grown men. Nobody made us do anything. Maybe I'm talking for my people as much as for yours. We saw he turned crazy and... We couldn't believe it and we followed him anyway. Things should never have gone this far. You seen the situation on the reservation? Better to die fighting than sick and weak. Maybe, but you... Your people deserve better. You okay, Charles? Not that really. me off. All this death, and for what? Just so we can have enough money to be mm -hmm. able to run away from what we've done? Yep. There used to be some... 
some reason to. Lines that couldn't be crossed. We even helped some folk. Those lines have been gone for some time now. The time has come for us to draw our own lines, Arthur. Decide where we go from here. I swear, back there, Dutch just stood and watched. Mm -hmm. If it wasn't for Eagle Flies, I'd be... I know. I feel like he's descended into the kind of man he told us never to be. Maybe. He's just become more who he really is. I don't know anymore. I just feel like a fool. That money, those bonds, whatever it is, I don't want a cent. There's too much blood on it. Let's just get this boy to his father. I agree. Your friend here, my friend, he's a brave man. Fearless. Always has been. This won't be in vain. We will try to round up more men from the north, wherever we can. Many are ready to fight. No, this is over for all of us. Peter! Yes. Peter! It's okay, brother. Save your breath. We're not too far. Try to hold on. You'll be with your father soon. Brother, not yet. Look, as the eagle flies. Bialyshach, it's the chief's son. I think he's been shot. Oh no, he is wounded. Bring him to me. My son. What are they gonna do now? They must move. And fast. I'll stay and help them. Yeah, I'll stay too. No, my friend. You have others who need you. Good people. I'm sorry, but we... We must pack and move.
Please, drink. Drink this. Rest a minute. Wenn ich besser Englisch könnte. Sie haben uns gerettet, als wir wirklich Hilfe brauchten. They were the family on when me and Charles were... Right? If Dutch would have stayed, Eagle Flies would be alive right now. I'm gonna call that one there. I'm probably still gonna keep playing, but um, I'm really sad about Eagle Flies. And I'm very pissed about Dutch and his, and the fact that he left us, even though apparently I'm like a son to him, but it doesn't really feel like it. And I don't think I am to him anymore. Uh, but yeah, huge thanks to all my patrons, and I will see you guys in the next one.